Hi friends, today I'm going to be showing you and your parents how you can set up your brand new iPad, right? So this year we have these new iPads attached to your iPad. You're going to see this quick card. You want to keep this quick card handy. You're going to need it when you log in, but it's the only thing you're going to need. So once you scan your quick card, you'll see what I mean. All your apps, Google Classroom, anything you want to access will be yours to access. So it makes signing in so much easier this year. Great. So this is how you do it. Turn on your iPad. It's a little button at the top, right? Press it on, power it on. You're going to remove the quick card. Make sure your parents help you with this, right? So you remove the quick card and your iPad is going to power on. And then you're going to see Uh, your iPad's going to power on. You see the Apple, right? So we know it's booting up. If it didn't turn on right away, it might need to be charged, and that's okay. You have your charger right here, right? So you can have your parents help you with that. They're going to charge your iPad. Now you see your home screen. So you just want to press home to open. So put your finger on home, and it's going to bring up all these great apps. Now these apps you'll get a chance to explore them, but first you wanna log into ClassLink because ClassLink is going to give you access to all of these things. You'll be able to get to each thing if you sign in through ClassLink. So you're going to scroll to the next page, find the blue icon with the white cloud. See it right there. You're gonna click on it with your finger and it opens up, right? Boom. Now, here comes this little quick card. Every time you want to sign into ClassLink to access all of your apps and all of your programs, you need your quick card. This is like a black and white squiggly UPC code. If you look on the iPad, you see something that looks just like that, right? It looks like it. You are going to touch that and it's going to bring up your camera. And at the top, it says, scan your quick card. This is just like taking a picture on a phone. You are going to make sure that you can take a picture of this, the quick card, and it's going to log you in. So I'm going to flip my camera around just because it makes it a little bit easier for me. I have my quick card here, and I'm going to take a picture. You take a picture by pressing the home button, right? Okay, so I'm going to scan my quick card, take a picture. You see that it's processing, and now, the last thing it's going to ask me to do is enable autofill. This is going to give you access to all of your passwords without having to enter each one. Um, so if you slide that to green, just touch on it, turn it green. Now every app is going to be signed in for the most part. So you'll have access to everything in that one quick step. Keep your quick card handy because this is how you're going to sign in using your iPad this year. So maybe keep it on the refrigerator, keep it somewhere safe, right? Because with this tool, you can sign into everything, one shot, you're done. Awesome. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact me or Ms. Lee Rizal about this and how to get set up. All right. I hope you guys enjoy your new iPads. They're awesome.